The Charles River Compendium is an online tool which gives you access to more than 700 different tumor models, including PDX, cell line derived models, as well as syngenetic lines. The PDX Compendium was used by us um, using the well known target EGFR in oncology, and we then used the selected models to showcase the feasibility of the selection in the different drug development platforms. So we used EGFR um, based on RNA, RNA expression and selected the models in the online compendium. We uh, selected high expressor as well as low expressors. And um, in the first attempt, we used 75 different lines in a 2D assay and screened more than 20 different EGFR targeting compounds. We saw there that we have around 25 high, expre high expressing models, which were highly sensitive and 23 resistant models. So we confirmed and even extended those data by using um, almost 300 different PDX models in our 3D assay, which is a soft agar based assay, um, where we tested 10 different EGFR targeting compounds in these 300 different PDX models. We saw high sensitive models, uh, mainly in the gastric cancer, as well as in non-small cell lung cancer and renal cancers but you as well identified highly resistant models. To show that our in vitro platforms are predictive for the more important in vivo part, we tested as well three of these EGFR targeting compounds. This was cetuximab, gefetinib and alotinib in 25 different PDX models in vivo. For the small molecules, gefetinib and alotinib, the predictivity of our in vitro 3D assay was uh, very high for the in vivo testing. To to give an additional layer to this drug development platform, we could also do bioinformatic as well as biomarker studies, which enabled us to identify uh, predictive biomarkers within our um, PDX collection, which um, can then be tested in a cl cl clinical as well as in a translational space.